Hi everyone, I'm Brian. I'm one of the acupuncturists at East Village Acupuncture and Massage. Today I'm going to show you how to do a position called constructive rest. Before I do, please like this video and subscribe to our channel so we can continue making content for you. Constructive rest is a position that we can take that allows the muscles of the body, the joints of the body to completely relax and the bones can just allow gravity to take them and let the earth support them. It's a particularly good position to take after you've had a back spasm of any kind. Whether that's low back, mid back, upper back, or your neck, it's a great opportunity to um, just allow the body to relax and begin to reset itself. Let's start, I'll show you how. I have a pillow set up for my head and I'm gonna come to lie on my back. So lying on my back, I'm gonna draw my knees to the ceiling and allow my feet to be flat on the floor. My feet are hip width apart, or maybe even a little bit wider, and I'm gonna allow my knees to knock together. I'm gonna rest my knees up against one another. From there, I can either cross my arms over my chest, like this, so the elbows are together, pointed towards the ceiling. I can relax like this, or I can place my hands on my ribs, and let my elbows be supported by the floor. And let everything go, let the body melt into the floor and be supported by the floor. Practice some conscious breathing. Breathing particularly into the area of pain or where you feel the spasm. And you can stay like this for five minutes, 10 minutes, 15 minutes. When you're ready to move, moving out of position should be done very consciously because it's often in the transition from lying to sitting or sitting to standing or lying to standing that we re-aggravate and re-injure the back. The best way to get out of the position is to roll over onto one side all the way. Roll all the way over and then press the top hand into the ground to lift yourself. Sitting position. I hope you find this video helpful. Be sure also to continue getting your regular acupuncture treatments so that hopefully your back will never spasm in the first place. Take care.